Hi everyone, Eric from Mr. Cook Eric here. Today's video is about our flight to China. Let's start from the beginning. We packed only two small suitcases and three backpacks. That's because we want to be convenient when we get off the plane because there are a lot of unusual procedures in the airport. Our flight is on June 14th at 035 and according to the Chinese government, you are required to take the PCR and IgM tests two days before your flight. We took our test at 7 a.m. on June 12th. We then received our results at 6.30 p.m. We then uploaded our test results, COVID-19 vaccination re records, itinerary papers to the Chinese government at about 7.10 p.m. Finally, at 10.30 p.m., we got the green code. It allows us to go board the plane. The red cloak does the opposite. We left our house at 8.10 p.m. and arrived at the airport at 8.30 p.m. One, one thing that really surprised all of us was that at the check-in, there was already a huge line, even though it was still four hours before the flight. Our flight was 35 minutes past midnight, but it was delayed for an hour. We just got our GoPro last week, so we are currently checking it out and testing it. Here my brother is recording the view from the windows of the gate. About 30 minutes before we can board the plane, the flight attendants who were wearing chemical protection suits boarded it as you can see here. Now that we were on the plane, here's an overall look at what they provided us. The airline provided packaged food as the things we can eat on the plane. Here are some very beautiful pictures of the sunrise on a plane. Finally, welcome everyone to Xiamen, Fujian Province, China. After we have landed at about China time 6 9 a.m., we then got off the plane at 6 30 a.m. Thirdly, a shuttle bus took us to the terminal. While the airport customs took our temperature, we also scanned the custom barcode, which we completed the steps for before we boarded the plane. The custom also handed us a printed version of the barcode for later uses. Then the airport custom split people into vaccinated or non-vaccinated. For the vaccinated people, they needed to show their vaccination records. After that, we had to get a PCR test with the printed version of our custom barcodes. Finally, after all of those steps, we went through normal customs and got on a bus which would take us to the place where they will pick the hotel we will quarantine in.